many people remain unemployed post the COVID-19 pandemic and that is why the social relief of distress grant is still in place. Independent analyst Kaya Sitolia says the grant is now a source of income for many with the latest SASA report showing over 17 million people applying in September. This represents an increase of over 3 million applicants since September 2021. I do think that it obviously reflects the reality of just how many people have become reliant on this grant as a form of some income assistance. And obviously this is reflective of a longer term pattern of people being unable to easily transition into the pathways of economic activity on their own. So what we've always had in South Africa is essentially a system where there is formal forms of assistance for people below a certain age, and that is the child support grant, which actually makes up the bulk of the numbers in relation to the volumes covered over 30 million. And then obviously what then happens is that people transition out of that social security net because they could become of age. And obviously until you then retransition back when you get to old age and you get access to the old age pension grant, you're essentially stuck in this middle period. Now, obviously in that middle period, you can either get an ability to work formally, which obviously means that your reliance on other forms of assistance will be, will be reduced, or you are stuck in limbo. It is those that are stuck in limbo that do not have formal jobs, that do not have prospects of employment, that then when the COVID-19 grant was introduced, became the type of audience that we paid a new eye to, a new form of attention to, in that we then said, look, we acknowledge that there are these individuals who are essentially in economic limbo, and because in some instances they would try and work something on their own, they would go and prospect for jobs in, in, in the informal sector. When COVID-19 said that you couldn't leave your house, it then meant that the state had the responsibility of asking the question of, well, if you know that they don't have formal jobs and you know that they rely on daily prospecting, 